of the blue corner with a record of two wins and one loss, fighting out of Gold's Gym, Las Vegas, Nevada. Two distinct body types going up against each other here in this tough enough match. Bumpus is wearing the multicolored trunks. Kressinger is wearing the black trunks, and we are set to go. Three two-minute rounds in this amateur bout. Six-foot-tall Kressinger says that his fighting style is boxing and karate. He comes out throwing fast kicks. Throwing that jab, throwing that kick. Oh, oh huge right hand for Bumpus. He connects. It stumbles Kressinger, but Kressinger does a nice job recovering. Instantly Ooh. says, come on, throws a head kick that just glances off the chin of Bumpus. These two are trading leather early on. Kressinger's got to gotta keep that distance, man, because Bumpus is strong. He's already flashed that power. Credit shirt seems to have recovered nicely already, though. Bumpus again with big shots. A couple of them land there. And now Kressinger wants none of it, gets the takedown. He is in top position. Trying to pass the side control. Bumpus has his has his neck. Yeah, Bumpus does have him tied up right now. It's an arm and guillotine attempt. The legs are not around the body. Very unlikely to be able to, be able to finish from here, but he is doing a nice job of controlling the advancements that Kressinger can make from this position. Still got a little time in this first round, about 50 seconds. Kressinger's in half guard now. Bumpus still has that really strong lock around his neck. I mean, I mean, I've seen guys muscle guillotines out of there. I don't think uh, he's going to do it right here. But his head out. Yeah, he's all right. Now he's posturing up, able to rain down some punches of his own. And Bumpus taking some damage right now. He's covering up. This could be the end. If the referee sees too much damage being done, he'll step in and stop it. Kressinger unloading right now. Referee telling Bumpus he's got to do something. Otherwise, he's going to stop this fight. Just about 10 seconds left here in this opening round. And Frank Trigg watching closely. Kressinger doing everything in his power, throwing every last punch that he can, trying to get this fight stopped. But the round comes to an end instead. It's entirely possible. Wow. But Sarnell Bumpus was saved by the bell. I, uh, Bumpus came out strong with a big, big shot there at the beginning that kind of put Kressinger kind of on it, kind, kind of on the defensive. He was backpedaling, recovered a little bit, but Kressinger came back with a vengeance, was active, was landing lots of strikes. I don't think he had Bumpus in any real uh, true I, danger. I, 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 it was, I, I, it was, I, I was a lot of volume, but there wasn't a lot of power no. behind it, but it was scoring a lot, and I think he snuck out that round. I, I actually totally disagree. He had him in real danger, maybe not because he was going to knock him out, but he was covering up, and he was unable to respond, and the real danger was that the referee was going to stop him. And what I mean by real danger is that you're this close to the fight being finished, and the judges are going to recognize the fact that the referee's hovering over going, I may step in because this fighter cannot defend himself, I would think that that would speak volumes to the judges. Who knows what the judges are watching tonight? Bumpus taking really deep breaths. Bumpus may have spent the majority of his energy but, there. But I mean, he is a big 155-pounder, really muscled up, you know, and being on the being on the the receiving end of a lot of those strikes and being on the bottom takes a lot of energy out of you. Still got that big right. Kressinger's got to just keep the distance. Use those kicks, use, the, use that length. And again, Kressinger's showing a good forward. chin, though. Definitely showing that, you know, he's got the experience. 11 fights in on his amateur career. Doing a good job. Bumpus kind of grabbing the cage. Frank Trigg yells at Bumpus right there and Kressinger the takedown. Kressinger for the takedown. He got it. He scooped both legs. Not a great takedown, but this is exactly what we saw in the last round where he gets the takedown. Ends up sacrificing his neck in the process, he's get, he's and he pops get it his out. head yep. out. Now, he's, he's gone to a seated mount right now. This is actually potentially a really bad spot for Bumpus because Kressinger I think is Bumpus just, is done. Yeah, this could be it. He's, I mean, Bumpus looks kind of like he's giving up right now. 
Pressner is doing a great job using this position. He's got him kind of pinned into a weird spot up against the cage. Trigg is watching closely, but again, Bumpus is just kind of flailing around right now, covering up. This could be it. Frank Trigg watching closely. That's there it. There you go. Wow. Chance Kressinger gets the victory tonight over Darnell Bumpus. Bumpus came out, landed a huge shot that dropped Kressinger, but the 20-year-old 20 20 -year fighter reverses the fortunes, does a nice job showing his experience, and gets the victory. You know, cardio is key there. This guy, he didn't have, he didn't have the power that Bumpus had. You know, I mean, you can see he's still bloodied up from that first round when he got, when he got clocked pretty well, or pretty good. And, you know, it just showed a lot of heart, determination, and his experience. You know, when you're a guy like Dar uh, Darnell Bumpus, who's coming in with only three fights, fighting a guy with 11 fights, you're, you're at a pretty significant disadvantage, in my opinion, even if you are, have been training for as long, because 11 fights in, that's a lot of experience inside the cage. And hats off to Chance Kressinger, showed his experience. You know, I would like to say that he's gonna have a great weekend here in Las Vegas, but 20 years old. All the buffets you want, man. There you go. But congratulations, you know. Certainly showed, uh, you know, if there's anybody here in the audience tonight from the UFC or Bellator or any of the other organizations, certainly had a certainly had a great showing. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute eight seconds into the second round, your winner by TKO. Some booing going on from the crowd. The crowd, obviously uneducated in this particular instance. Uh, a lot of a lot of Bumpus' friends. I can understand that they're sad to see their friend leave or lose, but you know it's kind of disrespectful to Kressinger, who showed a very respectful performance and a very dominant performance. No, well. I, I hate it. I, I think it's totally disrespectful. If your friend goes out there and engages in voluntary combat and loses because he got outclassed, you got to deal with that as yep. a friend and a fan. Yes, it sucks, but you don't boo a guy who traveled all the way from Iowa on his own dime, came out here at 20 years old, put on a good show. Congratulations to Chance Kressinger.